The idea of a bricklaying robot actually evolved out of an earlier idea for building big industrial patterns. There was a need for constructing big wooden objects that we could then machine to turn into things like boat moulds. And I sketched out a machine which would cut small pieces of wood to length and then stack them all up and it only ever stayed as an idea because I figured the worldwide market for that was about three machines. And that sat in the back of my mind for a few years until in about 2007 we had a shortage of bricklayers in Western Australia and a friend of mine came into work one day and said, Mark, you should build a bricklaying machine. And that's when it clicked, that I could take the technology that I'd been thinking about for years with no real application, and finally we had an application that was global and would need a significant number of machines. We see this as the start of construction automation. The stage of the project now is that we can see the pathway to commercialisation. We've developed the technology to a point now where we understand it completely. We have proven the components of the technology that we needed to prove to be sure that moving forward was safe, that we had de-risked and that the future for the project was very, very bright.